Paradigm Electronics is a manufacturer of high-performance loudspeakers and subwoofers. The entire production from R&D to finished product takes place in-house at facilities in Toronto, Canada. In trying to meet demand on labor-intensive products, Paradigm has now implemented universal robots in polishing applications. When several years ago we introduced uh, our signature uh, Midnight Cherry Finish, in our cabinets. The response was tremendous. We were faced with a challenge to, to make even more than we anticipated. In order to produce that finish, you have to apply multiple layers of lacquer. Between each layer application, you have to sand and buff, sand and buff, and there's a lot of manual labor involved in that. And the problem is to find people who can do that. Uh, there are just so many skilled people we came across. The answer was to introduce robots who could learn from people you just make one wrong move with the sandpaper and you leave a mark on the cabinet that cannot be repaired. Robot has to be as delicate and as sensitive as a human. Thanks to robots, we're able to increase our throughput by 50%. Once we realized that a collaborative robot was a viable alternative for us, of course we did our homework and checked around the rest of um, the opportunities that were out there from uh, different manufacturers. And we found that for our application, the UR robot was not only uh, the best robot for the application, but it was also the most cost efficient. We look at all the investments as a business case. So in case of robots, we found that in just 14 months, the robot will pay for itself. So the collaborative robot allowed us to have the robot and a human working in the same workspace. They're working in a pendulum type of an operation where they safely can interact. It's a very hand-in-hand -hand kind of an operation between the two. We had already implemented a different robot, a Cartesian type robot, that required a lot of protected devices uh, for the protection of the worker. It didn't allow for a worker really to work in conjunction with the robot at all, with all of the physical guards that are required in order to make the work cell safe for a human. Um, there's a long implementation period. The Cartesian robot took five months. The implementation from the time of receipt of the UR robot was just over a month. One of the important features of the universal robot was that it inherently had force control. And with the buffing process, if too much force is applied, uh, the surface heats and the results go the opposite direction to what you'd hope. So having the ability for the robot to work to a specific force was a huge advantage. We were aware of technologies that allowed for um, a force feedback system, but they were actually as expensive as the entire UR robot. The UR-10 robot was first introduced to Paradigm by distributor Advanced Motion and Controls, who brought the robot in for an on-site demo. I showed him how to do some dynamic teaching with the robot, where I would physically move the robot to the position where I need to be at, and then do my fine movements with the uh, teach pendant. Their programmer was able to do uh, you know, some of the fine points and didn't really have an issue. With the robot, it's more easy for us to do more um, quantity is faster. The robot is doing the hard job. You know, robot is doing very good quality too. The UR robot is very simple for the operator to um, start her day and carry on. The uh, programs are very easily found in a menu. It's only a few keystrokes and they have the robot up and operating for the day. We found this installation to be um, quite successful and are looking forward to some future applications. Uh, we're looking forward to be able to use it in close proximity with a painter uh, for our various paint processes. And uh, we're also bringing on a new line of speakers that have more of a parabolic shape. We feel that the other application of force that's available with the UR, where we determine a specific force at a particular point in the path of the robot, will be even more useful. This way we can uh, produce all the cabinets that we need uh, with the same beautiful finish and everybody's happy.